Hi, I'm Gary from organicweb.com.au and I'm a MailChimp partner. In this short video, I'll show how we can identify those contacts in MailChimp that are most engaged with our marketing. This is important because in marketing we have the concept of top of mind or front of mind where we want our consumers to have our brain at the front of their minds when they come to make the purchasing decision. So people that are engaged with our marketing are typically front of mind or top of mind. So let's go across to MailChimp itself. You'll notice that I'm in my audience at the moment. It's just a demo audience. And what we're looking for here is the contact rating field. You'll notice it's, it's up to five stars, one to five stars. The people that are most engaged would be five stars. And those that aren't engaged at all or have unsubscribed or are what we term cleaned would be a one star. So everyone new that we add, all contacts that are new that we add to a MailChimp audience are added as two star. As they start opening and clicking more and more, they'll go up. So a three star is probably opening some of your emails. A five star would be clicking and opening probably almost all of your emails. So what we want to do is we want to create a segment to identify those people that are engaged with our marketing. We want to create a segment in MailChimp where people are above two star, in other words, three, four, and five star, because these people are engaged with our marketing. Once we have that segment, we can use that segment in our marketing to target those people that are either very engaged, in other words, three, four, or five, or those people that aren't engaged, in other words, probably the one stars. So to create the segment, we click New Segment. And what we're looking for, I'm going to click the email marketing status uh, drop up or drop down. And I'm looking um, here for the contact rating. So I'm going to click contact rating. So where my contact rating, and I, and I can choose a selector, is, is not, is greater than or is less than. So let's go is greater than two stars. So this would be all people that are three, four, and five. I'll click preview segment. And I'll just scroll across. And again, this is just a demo audience. But you can notice now all these people are three and above, three to five star. I now need to save my segment so that when I come to create my email marketing, I can use this segment to target my uh, email marketing, for example. So I'll click Save Segment, and I can call it whatever I want. So let's call this Engaged People, for example. But you can call it anything that makes sense, and click Save. What I'll do is just to illustrate that this has worked, I'll click on my contact numbers just to refresh my audience. So at any time now, I can click View Segment, and you can see I now have a segment called Engaged People, and I can use this in my email marketing to target my most engaged contacts. Thanks for joining me. I'm Gary from organicweb.com.au.